Rihanna has a garden. In the beginning of summers, she went to her garden and saw that the trees were filled with bunches of unripe mangoes. She was very happy to see that. Now she was thinking when, the, when would those unripe mangoes would ripe and so she could change the delicious fruit of summer. So ripening of the mango is desirable for her. Now in the summer vacations, she went on a tour to Darjeeling and forgot about the mangoes. After the tour, when she returned, she went to her garden, but she found this. All the mangoes in her garden had already rotten. This was not what she had desired. So rotting of mangoes here is undesirable change for her. She had thought that the mangoes would ripe and she could taste the delicious fruit. But actually what happened? The mangoes rotten. So we can say that changes can be classified into two ways like desirable change and undesirable change. So what is a desirable change? Desirable change are changes that are useful to us, that we want to happen. Such as formation of curd from milk. Curd forms from milk overnight. This is a desirable change as we want to taste the delicious curd. Now what about spoilage of food? Is it desirable? No, it is not desirable because it is harmful to us. We cannot eat the spoiled food. So what is an undesirable change? Change that are harmful to us, that we do not want to happen. Now answer this. Destruction caused by floods. Is it a desirable change or undesirable change? Well, no one wants destruction to take place. So it is an undesirable change. We do not desire the destruction caused by floods. So it is an undesirable change. As this type of change is harmful to us. Now, a change can be desirable or undesirable depending upon the effect it creates. Now suppose your parents want to increase the time for doing your homework. Now this may not be desirable for you. You don't want to do the homework for so long. But it is desirable for your parents. They want good marks. So they will increase the time of your homework. Now, burning of fuel to generate electricity. This is a desirable change as it will give us electricity. But it also causes pollution. This is undesirable. So it is desirable for some people, but also undesirable as it, it creates pollution. Now you answer, heavy rainfall, it is desirable or undesirable? Well, you may say that it is undesirable. You want to go and play outside, but due to heavy rainfall, you cannot go. So it is undesirable. But it is also desirable for farmers as they need heavy rainfall to grow crops. So we learn that changes can be classified into desirable and undesirable changes.